Hello everyone, I am Arpit Kumar Sharma and welcome back to Pabli. So today I am going to tell you how you can add leads to your go high level CRM by adding a new rows in your Google Sheets. Now, suppose you have been receiving several types of details with the contacts of the customer on your Google Sheets or the employees of your company are you know uh, making calls and they are you know grabbing contacts from different customers and they are putting those contacts in google sheets now what will happen the details from the google sheets will be used by the go high level crm and those details will automatically go to go high level crm and a new contact will be created in your go high level crm now to do this automation we are going to use an integration and automation service pably connect which will help us connect google sheets and go high level crm automatically now if you want to learn how to do this automation you have to come with me to the screen and we are here at our screen now what we have to do we have to go to the address bar and type in p a b b l y pebbly dot com slash connect and as soon as you will do that you will be redirected to this beautiful web page and here you have two options either you can sign in or you can sign up now signing in is absolutely easy because if you already have an account you can go and sign in directly if you want to sign up signing up is absolutely free and signing up will only take two minutes for you to do and also we are giving you 100 free tasks every month from our side so that you can practice the workflows that we are teaching you here okay so just go for sign up if you do not have an account i already have an account here so i will just go for sign in now as you can see this is the place where I, have, uh, where I have all my software. So here I will just go for Pabli Connect access now. And now here my dashboard will come and you can see these are all the automations I have been doing. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a new workflow here. Now here I'm going to name it Google Sheets to go high level okay so what i'm doing here is i am integrating google sheets with go high level so i'm just going to name this if you want you can uh, you know name you can change the name according to yourself and now what i'm going to do i'm just going to click on create now after clicking on create you can see i have two windows here first one is trigger second one is action now trigger window is the window where an event is happening at the start of the process and action window is the window where the final event is happening or when the event is happening at the end of the process so trigger means when this happens action means do this okay so what is happening here we are going to add rows in our google sheets okay so trigger event will be new or updated spreadsheet row and before i go to my spreadsheet let me create one so i'll just go here and I will just go on sheets and as you can see this is my sheet and we can just take any sheet here let me see okay let's take this one contact information okay this one is good so let's just delete some things and uh, let me come back at you really quick so as you can see <coughs> I have uh, created a new sheet here and let me just name this sheet here as go high level sheet okay so this is the name of my sheet go high level sheet and here what i am going to do here i am going to add first name last name email and contact number and then what we are going to do we are first going to connect our google sheets with our pebbly connect account here okay so first let me just Right, Arpit Sharma email is Arpit Sharma at the rate gmail.com and contact number is a dummy contact number I'm using here okay nine eight seven six five four five six seven eight now here you can see i have filled in all the information uh, in my google sheets now what we are going to do we are going to connect our google sheets to our pebbly connect account and now how we are going to do that so to do that we are going to use this webhook url here i will just copy this webhook url and i will follow all the steps here which are given below here 
एंड बाय फॉलोइंग दीज स्टेप्स आई एम गोइंग टू मेक अ कनेक्शन नाउ आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू रीड दैट मच यू कैन जस्ट रीड इट आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ इट्स डन सो आई विल गो टू गूगल शीट्स हेयर फर्स्ट आई विल गो टू एक्सटेंशन एंड देन आई हैव दिस पेबली कनेक्ट वेब हुक्स हेयर इफ यू डो नॉट हैव दिस पेबली कनेक्ट वेब हुक्स इन योर गूगल शीट्स यू कैन जस्ट गो टू एड ऑन्स क्लिक ऑन गेट एड ऑन्स आफ्टर दैट यू हैव टू गो हेयर एंड हेयर यू हैव टू टाइप pebbly connect web hooks when you will type this you can see this is the extension which we need here i have already installed it in my system so i do not need it again you can go and install it now after that what you are going to do when it is installed you have to go to the pebbly connect web hooks extension and here it is written initial setup so just click on initial setup and what you are going to do here you are going to paste the url that you copied from your pebbly connect account which was this one okay now what we are going to do we are going to put a trigger column here now what is the trigger column trigger column is the column which will trigger the uh, google sheets to send the response to your pebbly connect account and trigger column will always be the last data column in your spreadsheet in my case the last data column is d in your case it can be e f g h or even b or c okay and here you have to first click on submit and as soon as you will submit it you will go back again to extensions then pebbly connect web hooks then initial setup and after that what you are going to do you are going to click on send test and as soon as you will click on send test you can see the test data has been sent successfully arpit sharma arpit sharma at the rate gmail.com now we will go back to pebbly connect and let uh, we will see that uh, our response is here or not now here we will come and we will see if we have our response or not and we have our response here first name arpit second name uh, or last name i should say sharma email arpit sharma at the rate gmail.com this is the contact number and this is the uh, go high level sheet uh, spreadsheet name now we have successfully connected our google sheets to our pebbly connect account now what we are going to do we are going to now select go high level so what we will do we will just click on high level and let me first go and open my high level account here now you can see this is my go high level account and now what we have to do we have to make a contact here so what we will do we will go here and here what we are going to do we are making a new contact so we will click on create contact okay now i will just click on connect now here what i am going to do i am just going to show you how you can connect your go high level so what you have to do first you have to put a token here now to get the token what you need to do if you are creating a location or if you are creating a user you have to put the agency api key okay if you are doing anything else or if you are using any other action event apart from these two you have to get the api key from your company okay from your company account now let me just show you really quick how it's done so we will go to our go high level and here you can see agency dashboard what you can do is you can just go to your settings and then you will go to your uh, this option api keys and here this is the agency api keys and this is the location api key so whenever whenever you are going to create a location or you are going to create a user you will go for agency api keys okay here it is written go to agency settings api keys if you are uh, you know using any other action event like we are using con create contact so we are going to take the company api key so this is the company api key where it is written location api key now what we have to do we have to choose the account uh, in which we want to create our contact so there are so many accounts here you can see arya business arya associates magnet brains magnet brains software and etc 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 now what i am going to do i am going to create a new account in arya associates so what i will do i will go for this api key which has been written or i should say which has been automatically uh, fetched from the arya associates account and we will just copy this and now we will go to our pebbly connect account and here we will just paste it now it means whenever we are going to create a new contact 
द कॉन्टैक्ट विल बी मेड इन आर्या एसोसिएट्स अकाउंट ओके यू कैन नॉट सी दैट कॉन्टैक्ट इन आर्या बिजनेस यू कैन नॉट सी दैट कॉन्टैक्ट इन मैग्नेट ब्रेन्स यू विल ओनली सी दैट कॉन्टैक्ट इन आर्या एसोसिएट्स एंड इन आर्या एसोसिएट्स ओनली ओके नाउ लेट्स जस्ट गो बैक एंड क्लिक ऑन सेव नाउ एज यू कैन सी आई हैव सक्सेसफुली कनेक्टेड माई गो हाई लेवल टू माई पेब्लिक कनेक्ट अकाउंट नाउ इट इज आस्किंग मी फॉर द फर्स्ट नेम लास्ट नेम फुल नेम ई मेल फोन नंबर एड्रेस सिटी कंट्री स्टेट पोस्टल कोड टैक्स सो वट आई एम गोइंग टू डू आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू फिल इन दोज इन्फॉर्मेशन विच आर अवेलेबल टू मी इन माई गूगल शीट्स और थ्रू माई गूगल शीट्स सो वट आई विल डू इज आई विल यूज अ टेक्निक विच इज कॉल्ड मैपिंग एंड मैपिंग विल लेट मी टेक द डेटा फ्रॉम फ्रॉम दिस विंडो हेयर and it will let me put the data in this window now let's see how it's done just go here first name arpit so i mapped arpit now here i am going to map sharma i did that too full name we can just go for arpit space sharma email email was arpit sharma at the rate gmail.com phone number phone number was uh, this 9876545678 Now what we are going to do? We are going to put the okay. I am really sorry. We are not going to put anything now because I have already you know used all of the information from my Google Sheets. Now you can put address, city, country, state, postal code fields in your Google Sheets, and then you can map it if you want it. I did not want it, so I did not use it. Now what I am going to do? I am just going to click on Save and Send Test Request. and as soon as i will do that you can see here it is written contact id is this and contact first name lower case letter is arpit which means our contact has been created in our go high level account so i will just go to accounts and here you can see arya associates i will just click on arya associates and here let me just go to our associates here and now we are going to see the contacts so this is the contacts part contacts and here as soon as i will refresh it and you can see we have our a new contact here arpit sharma 9876545678 arpit sharma at the rate @gmail.com and this is our uh, date on which date it has been created now what we will do we are going to add another contact here let me just cancel it but before adding another contact let me tell you one thing or before adding another row let me tell you one thing that if you want to keep adding contacts to go high level crm what will happen whenever you will uh, you know whenever you will create a new row in google sheets the data will not be sent and why is that because first we have to click on this uh, uh, you know option send on event because without it the google sheet uh, the google sheets will not pass on that data to the pebbly connect account and from there go high level will not be able to take the data so first we have to click on send on event and when you will do that it will show a right uh, sign like this which means now we can add our new contact here so i'll just go for rajan avasthi rajan at the rate gmail.com and again a number dummy number 9879876545678 good now we will go back to our go high level account and we will see that rajan avasthi contact is there or not so you can see rajan avasthi 9876789876 rajan@gmail.com and this has also been created on february 25 2022 so our integration is successful and friends this is how you can Uh, contact your Google Sheets to your Go High Level account so that whenever there is a new entry in the Google Sheets, an automatic contact will be created in your Go High Level account, and 
you can use this in your business so i just want to say if you want to copy this beautiful workflow you can just clone it from my description box in your account but for that you need to have an account and to have an account you need to go and sign up signing up is absolutely free and it will also give you 100 free tasks from our side every month so that you can practice the workflows that we are teaching you so keep learning and keep subscribing hasta la vista so thanks a lot for watching our video i hope you understood everything now if you want any other events to edit in our module what you can do is you can mail us at admin at the rate pebbly.com if you have any queries regarding this software you can just ask your queries at this website at this link and if you want to check the prices you can visit here to this link and check the prices of the software now i just want to tell you that automation is a boon for us and it can change the future and i will you know suggest you to take this as quickly as possible which will ease your task save your time and save you a lot and lot of efforts thank you